In this video we're going to explore one of the most fascinating and chilling ideas in the future of artificial intelligence. The idea that once we create a super predictor AI, sometimes referred to as Laplace's demon, humanity relationship, humanity's relationship with time, free will and the universe itself changes forever. So what is Laplace's demon? Quick rundown. Let's do the QRD, a quick rundown on Laplace's demon. Pierre Simon Laplace, a French mathematician, envisioned a hypothetical being, not a literal demon, but a kind of godlike intelligence that could predict the entire future of the universe with perfect accuracy. The idea was this, this if this intelligent knew the precise position and momentum of every particle in the universe and understood the laws of physics completely, he could calculate what happened in the past and what will happen in the future. This being could, in theory, look at the present moment and see the entire timeline, every move, every choice, every fluctuation of every atom in advance. Now fast forward to today and we begin to see how this abstract idea could become real. Not through magic or metaphysics but through super intelligent AI and unprecedented computational power. The future and their final invention, the super predictor AI. Break Greek Creating a Laplace-like super AI would effectively be the final invention of any civilization. Why? Because once you have the machine that can accurately simulate the future, you can make optimal decisions about anything, economics, war, politics, science, even relationships. It's not just a tool for prediction, but a tool. it's a tool for control. Imagine a government or a corporation running trillions of simulations in real time, tweaking every input, monitoring every human, and predicting reactions with extreme precision. At that time, there's no need to wait for the future to happen. The future is already known. Strategic decisions are made not by human intuition, but by godlike algorithm playing the galaxy like a chessboard. The observer effect, a universe in a feedback loop. But we're here, here's where it gets weird. Just like quantum mechanics, where observing a system changes its state, Every time someone looks at these simulations, the future changes slightly. The more people who use the prediction systems, the more the simulations must account for their very act of observing the output. This creates an infinite feedback loop of meta-simulations problems. Uh, to simulate the future accurately, you AI must simulate itself simulating the future. And then you simulate, are you reacting to that simulation? And then simulate the simulation of that reaction. As more AIs are built, each each more advanced than the last, the complexity of the simulations increase exponentially. Soon you're not simulating just a physical world, you're simulating an informational universe where the observers become the dominant variables. The prediction arms race, the war of futures. Now imagine every nation, corporation or advanced AI having access to its own version of Laplace's demon. What happens? A race. A prediction power arms race, where each system is trying to simulate the future faster, more accurately, and with deeper layers of awareness than the others. If if this this isn't a war, well, a war of weapons, it's a war of timelines. The first AI to predict a certain chain of events to get to act first. In a universe where foresight is power, the winner isn't always the strongest. It's the one who sees the furthest ahead. The only way to stay competitive is to simulate not just present and future, but your competitive simulations of you. This leads to recursive models where AI must account for every other AI models and so on. It's game theory on a cosmic scale, an endless loop of predictive escalation. The galaxy scale computation, the end game. Eventually this scale is beyond planets. If prediction is power, then the first civilization to simulate the entire solar system or a whole galaxy will dominate it. Resources will be poured into building galactic scale computers, Dyson spheres around stars, AI cores around the size of planets. The goal? To simulate every interaction in the galaxy before it even happens. Preemptive prediction becomes the highest form of intelligence. A civilization that doesn't want, wait for threats because it's already neutralized them in the future. Sim space before they existed. We move from AI prediction nations to simulated omniscient nations. At this point, existence becomes a predictive loop. Everyone 
every move modeled, every outcome tested, every universe variant scanned, and then and we may not even notice it. The cost, free will, and reality collapse. But there's a catch. In such a world, free will collapses. In the fu if the future is calculable, your choices aren't really yours. They're predetermined by in initial conditions. You might just feel like you have a choice, but you're way walking a path selected by a machine that already knows your destination. Some might resist this, others will embrace it, but either way, once the demon is created, you cannot uninvent it. Final thoughts. What comes after that Blaster's Demon? Once we build that Blaster's Demon, a perfect simulator, a super AI that sees the future, we may discover that we are no longer the ones writing history. Instead, we become characters in the script of pre-written mach by machines with deeper understanding of time than we evolved to ever handle. It may lead to utopia, it may lead to a collapse, but one thing is certain, the moment we create Lapbus's demon, we stop living in the present, and we start living in the shadow of our simulations.